love is all you need. All you need is love. All together now. All you need is love. Everybody. All you need is love. Love, love. The fierce dinosaur was trapped inside his cage of ice. Although it was cold, he was happy in there. It was, after all, his cage. Then along came the lovely other dinosaur. The lovely other dinosaur melted the dinosaur's cage with kind words and loving thoughts. I like this dinosaur, thought the lovely other dinosaur. Although he is fierce, he is also tender, and he is funny. Don't know where she got that from. <laughs> He is also quite clever though. I will not tell him this for now. I like this lovely other dinosaur, thought the dinosaur. She is beautiful and she is different and she smells so nice. She is also a free spirit, which is a quality I much admire in a dinosaur. But he can be so distant and so peculiar at times, thought the lovely other dinosaur. He is also overly fond of things like Xboxes, <laughs> are all dinosaurs so overly fond of things. But her mind skips from here to there so quickly, thought the dinosaur. She is also uncommonly keen on shopping. Are all other, are all lovely other dinosaurs so uncommonly keen on shopping? <laughs> I will forgive his peculiarity and his concerns for things, thought the lovely other dinosaur, for they are part of what makes him a richly charactered individual. I will forgive her skipping mind and her fondness for shopping, thought the dinosaur, for she fills our life with beautiful thoughts and wonderful surprises. Besides, I'm not unkeen on shopping either. Now the dinosaur and the lovely other dinosaur are old, look at them, Together they stand on the hill telling each other stories and feeling the warmth of the sun on their backs. And that, my family of friends, is how it is with love. Let us all be dinosaurs and love the other dinosaurs together, like these wonderful two. For the sun is warm and the world is a beautiful place. I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. As a sign of our marriage. And my love for you. And my love for you. I promise you my friendship. I promise you my friendship. My respect. <laughs> <laughs> my respect. And my trust forever. My trust forever. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of our marriage. As a sign of our marriage. And my love for you. And my love for you. I promise you my friendship. I promise you my friendship, my respect, my respect, and my trust forever. And my trust. Forever. In the presence of your family and friends, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law and have made a solemn and binding contract with each other. You've symbolised your marriage by the joining of hands and the giving of rings. I therefore only have one remaining duty to perform and it gives me distinct pleasure to pronounce you as husband and wife together. Gary, give your beautiful wife a kiss. <laughs> There once was a boy named Gary, who wanted someone to marry. He found the one, but he was wrong, so he kept searching for one, a love that was strong. I know the one, said Ange and Deck, and a meeting was arranged. I can't say if it was love at first sight, but phone numbers were exchanged. She was young, tall and gorgeous, all those things he is not. Thanks, Emmy. We were just as surprised as anyone that he even had a shot. 
And Gary, I tell you, as a mate, you're punching well above your weight. <laughs> There's his one first true love that you cannot ignore. I'm sorry, Nicola, you'll always be second place to him being a poor. <laughs> he's the king on the dance floor and a great friend to chat until he's playing Monopoly and turns into a twat. <laughs> he's kind and clever and funny and he always have your back. May your days be sunny and if he gets grumpy, just give him a snack. <laughs> Preferably dry bread. <laughs> so I wish you two the happiest life Let's all raise our glasses to the new husband and wife. If there's one thing that I can promise you, it's that the things that we've done are just the start of our adventures. And we're going to go everywhere. We're going to fill our lives with new experiences so you, so I never let you down for choosing me. If you can all stand up, please, and raise a glass. Raise a glass to this amazing woman and the fact that she said yes. <laughs> to us, Mr. and Mrs. Shepherd.